Hello everyone and thank you for visiting my channel. Um, make sure you like, subscribe, leave a comment and share. I was tagged into a small YouTuber's tag by Windfire69 and I saw everybody doing it from work. So I am on my break and I am doing my uh, video. Now, I think they all show what they were wearing, so that's what I'm gonna do now. This is pretty much how I dress at work. Not that I am required to dress like this. I just like to respect the culture and dress accordingly to the culture. So I pretty much wear a scarf and my Kendora. Let me stand back so you can see the Kendora in full view. Okay, so that is a Kendora. I pretty much wear them every day, different colors, different styles, just to show respect for the culture. And I'm carrying my trusty um, Norm Normandy, yes, Normandy uh, in the DE print. And this is what I'm carrying. I will carry that to the end of the school year. Okay. Uh, I have my questions. I wrote them down. Such a stickler. Um, first question was, what inspired you to make videos? Well, I started my... This time, the reason why I started making videos is because I am a new empty nester. Our babies, our last set, and I say last set because they're triplets, uh, moved out and started school. So it's just my husband and I. And I wanted to find a hobby, but I'm not very active. I'm not very outdoorsy. So I started making videos just to have something to do so I won't sit home and watch TV and eat all day, every day. So that's why I started doing videos. And um, I was really into YouTube because I started looking for videos of people like myself, people who had like interests like I do. So I started watching videos of women who had uh, similar hairstyles. I started watching videos of women who um, did reviews on foundation for dark skin. And then I also started watching videos of women who were going through weight loss surgery. and looking for women who carry Louis Vuittons. It was hard because in my group of women that I hang with, we all like different brands. So I was the only one in my circle that liked Louis Vuitton, and I didn't see many brown girls carrying Louis Vuittons. So I started looking at videos of brown girls carrying Louis Vuittons, and that just opened up a whole nother world for me. So that's why I started doing videos, because if somebody looking for like me, we're looking for brown girls carrying Louis Vuittons. And I said, well, let me do videos of myself carrying Louis Vuittons. So that is uh, pretty much why I start making videos, um, just so I can be a resource to somebody else. Um, how long have you been on YouTube? Well, I started my YouTube channel in 2013. At that time, I was a director with Mary Kay Cosmetics. and. I was doing more of an informational video of some of the products and uh, just trying to get out there. So that's why I started in 2013 and then I stopped and I started back two months ago. So I started in 2013, did about three or four videos, stopped, and now I came back two months ago. Um, where do you see your channel in five years? Um, hopefully, uh, my channel will explode, blow up, get very popular. I want to do a lot of videos with some people that I am um, subbies with. So I would like to like go visit One Fire and uh, we go shopping and do a video. I would like to go see like Kelly Price and do a video with her. So it's a lot of people that I'm hoping in the future that I can do videos with and we can vlog together and we can put it on each other's pages and have fun. So just mainly just to connect and 
try to form a sisterhood with like people, like-minded people. So that's why I see my, my YouTube in five years. Uh, what message are you trying to get across? Um, I'm trying to get across that empty nesters, grandmothers, um, people who are in the next stage of their life can still be active, still have fun, still do things. Uh, because now I'm in that over 40s group. I still want to do a lot of things that I did when I was younger or if I feel like I'm young enough to do. So I just want to inspire all our women who are like me. We're getting ready to celebrate our 20th anniversary. So all the women who are married, celebrating anniversaries, grandmothers, empty nesters, uh, people who are just mature, just inspire them to get active, have fun, meet new people, just enjoy the next stages of your life. Um, do people from school find your channel? Uh, well, two parts. As a teacher, no, my students do not find my channel because I teach pre-K. And also, I teach in a English as a second language type school. So watching my videos might, might be a little difficult for them because English is not their first language. And then as far as my classmates, school for me, um, no, because I was in a transitional education system myself. Being a teen mom and uh, dropping out of school and then going to a school for pregnant girls and then dropping out of that and then going to get my GED and then getting into a uh, community college. I moved around a lot, so I don't have any set um, school friends. I do have a couple people that I'm friends with on Facebook that I remember from community college, but nobody really before that. Who is your favorite small YouTubers? Um, I have a lot of YouTubers that are my favorites, so I'm just gonna name the ones that I watch the most. So James Caldwell, One Fire 69, Jerusha Couture, Lady B, Black Diabetic Info. Now that's a good one, Black Diabetic Info. Um, she's one of my very few YouTubers that I know personally, and she is awesome. She has a slogan, diagnosed but not defeated and then she go around the world and do workshops about uh, diabetic solutions and uh, foods, nutrition, exercise, information. Go check her out. She has some funny videos of what people say to her when they find out she was diabetic and she tell you like what to eat on airplanes when you travel. Just awesome, awesome, awesome. So make sure you go to her Black Diabetic Info. Um, Yanni Rose, Bipolar Max, Lux Mommy, Coco Film. Coco Film is another one. She's like a trifecta for me. I watch her for her hairstyles. I watch her for makeup tips. I also watch her for her weight loss information. So Coco Film is another good one to look at. Minx for All, Lily, MLX, uh, The Glamour Girl, and like I said before, Kelly Price. So I hope I did justice to this tag. And um, thank you everybody for visiting my page. Thank you for my tags. Like I said before, I'm still new to YouTube um, in this arena and I don't know anybody to tag, but if I was to tag somebody, I think I would tag Coco Femme, um, Black Diabetic Info, um, Cause I think everybody else has been tagged. Okay, so I'm gonna tag those two. Coco Film and Black Diabetic Info. So thank you guys, love you, talk to you later. And um, hopefully I have some new videos coming out soon. Bye-bye.